I was in Moorhead, Kentucky at Moorhead State University hoping to bring you a baseball game. And as you can tell, earlier in the day, the skies were blue. People were outside enjoying a beer, something to eat. Then the weather got a little bit colder, so we ducked inside the brewery, which is uh, quite nice if you're in town. Had some of this amazing pizza from across the street from Pasquale's and hope that things worked out a little bit better uh, as the day progressed. And that was damn good pizza. But, as you can tell, this is what it looked like when we first got to Moorhead, or arrived. And then the weather got a little bit colder, the skies became cloudier. But this is what I can show you from my visit to Moorhead. A rained out game under cloudy skies. I hope you guys enjoy. And please, subscribe and check out Sawstone Brewing. Alright, we're going to bring you a baseball game here today at Moorhead, Kentucky. Sunny Allen Field right there, but as you can tell, the weather changed on us. It started raining, and they decided to cancel the game. This would have been the concession stand right here where you would get all your food. Not tonight, so uh, I don't know when I'll be packed to Boarhead. Perhaps next year, maybe the year after. When that happens, we'll bring you a game. Trust me. Well, guys, we have a rain out. We were going to give you some more head state baseball, but unfortunately, we are rained out. No baseball. And this is what we're left with, unfortunately. Bumper dudes. And the rain's pitter pattering as we speak. That's just how it is. I'll tell you something, when you go to different ballparks and review them and travel, you do battle Mother Nature, especially in early spring. Yesterday, 80 degrees. Today, almost 90. Tonight, raining. Storms are coming in. Nice cold night for baseball. But as you can tell, there's nobody here because we got rained out here at Moorhead State. I would have loved to bring you the action of a game, but... It's uh, not terrible right now, but it's going to be pretty bad in a few hours. We have this beautiful scenery behind us that we're going to be unable to give you because of Mother Nature. And you know what? It isn't kind to mess with Mother Nature. So this is probably my first time I've uh, had to bring you one of those videos where it got rained out. Kind of a first for me. You do get a nice view of the football stadium. Not a fancy stadium, but it has a wonderful little hill in the background. And when it's the fall, those beautiful colors of red and orange really highlight everything here. And once again, there's the football field. Always love the football field here. Not things spectacular, but an awesome view of the hill from behind. All right, there's Sunny Gray, there's uh, the stadium steps. So you walk up. And you come up to the concourse. And you toe to the left. You go to the right. There you go. So if you want to be cheap and not pay the five, six bucks to get in, you can just watch the game from here. Set up a lawn chair, I'm sure, on a very nice day. That is quite the sight here but not today and be a little careful here that's a little bit of a steep steep little hill you may hurt yourself now i'm standing outside the stadium on a hill overlooking third base the tarp is on today one great aspect of uh attending a game here at the ballpark is that you can watch it for free you do not have to pay i don't know i think it's five six bucks to enter uh, to see a game. Unfortunately, that's not going to be the case today. Nice looking stadium. You got that high net over here. Nothing spectacular. It's a little bit of an odd field dimension. Let's look at this field. Let's take a look at this field dimension. This left field shoots out very long, and that right field looks a little shorter. I'm not sure if I'm just seeing things. But I feel like if you are a lefty, you're going to hit some triples. And if you're a righty, 
you're going to hit some homers off of that. You're going to hit some balls off that net. Kind of interesting. All right, so that does it to our visit to Moorhead State. Let me get out of here because I'm the only person here. And hopefully they did not close the door. No, they did it. It's open down there. Uh, so we will see you next time. This is Mark the Ballpark Hunter saying goodbye, take care, and let's hope for better weather as we make our travels to our favorite ballparks and stadiums around the country. Have a great day. Be safe. I'm the Ballpark Hunter. If you like my videos, please hit subscribe as I visit another ballpark.